Hi, this is Nikki, and I'm here to share messages that I get from spirit and for all of us who are all on this journey to love and to reunite with our divine vibrational matches in this lifetime. And so today I'm going to be drawn to pull a wisdom of love oracle card as to what they want to say or what do we need to know that what's happening at the moment around our reunions. So this is from the wisdom of love oracle deck. And so the message is, let's see, and it is, look at that, TikTok, the divine clock. Uh, so this gift has been given to you by the divine. If you're in one of these connections, then no matter how crazy it seems, just remember it's all about divine timing, everything. So the message is love, the fulfillment of desire, and even the body's reproductive cycles have their own timetable. Some things are preordained and cannot be coerced. Everything has its season, its divine and appropriate timing, especially when it comes to matters of the heart. Remember that you always have enough time for love, to find it, to nurture it, to give and receive it. Its clock is eternal and ticks according to the beating of your heart in perfect rhythm. Isn't that wonderful to know that love is always right on time? So that's so, <clears throat> again, a perfect message to get to remember that this is all about divine timing. It's all about trust. It's all about believing that this is the, like it's number three, the divine energy. And so just as I was doing this message, a song came on the radio and it is Jerry Rafferty, Write Down the Line. And uh, this is such a special song for me. I used to, um, my dad, who I'm estranged from, he used to play it uh, when we used to go skiing. <clears throat> and my twin is a uh, skier. And um, he used to play this album over and over again when we used to drive um, to go skiing. So when it came on the radio, I really listened this time to the lyrics and... Um, I am going to read the lyrics because it's very poignant and very special. So the lyrics, the song is right down the line and the message is, you know I need your love, you've got that hold over me. As long as I've got your love, you'll know that I'll never leave. When I wanted you to share my life, I had no doubt in my mind and it's been you, woman, right down the line. I know how much I lean on you. Only you can see the changes that I've been through have left their mark on me. You've been as constant as a northern star, the brightest light that shines. It's been you, woman, right down the line. I just want to say this is my way of telling you everything I could never say before. This is my way of telling you that every day I'm loving you so much more. Because you believed in me through my darkest night, put something better inside of me. You brought me into the light, threw away all those crazy dreams. I put them all behind <clears throat> and it was you right down the line. <clears throat> I just want to say this is my way of telling you everything I could never say before. This is my way of telling you every day I'm loving you so much more. <clears throat> if I should doubt myself, if I'm losing ground, I won't turn to someone else. They'd only let me down. When I wanted you to share my life, I had no doubt in my mind. And it's been you right down the line. <clears throat> okay, so just a perfect message. So I'm going to read letter 30 from the Divine Love Letter books because it is that message of... <clears throat> when the time is right, I had no doubt in my mind, it's you I want to share my life with. So, uh, 30 is the letter. So let's have a look. <clears throat> it is this. Uh, <laughs> God. Uh, so you are light to me. In the parts of me that I'd long forgotten about and put in a box. But meeting you made me not want to live in a box. It made me want to become more of me. More of me so I can be everything that I am for you. Meeting you reminded me of who I am. I love you so very much. It's in the cells of my body, in the blood in my veins, in the beat of my heart. You're what I hear, what I see, what I smell. 
You are my senses. I count down the days, seconds, until we can experience all our senses merging together again in a beautiful symphony of love. We will create the perfect divine note to send out to the world. We will let our hearts sing. <laughs> Just as I'm doing a letter from a song as well. We are, will let our hearts sing. There you go. So letter 30, book two is stick with me. Don't veer off the path and start to give in to any fears and doubts that come up because of what I do or say. Know that it's all part of our plan because it's already set out for us. And as long as we stay true to our hearts and we don't panic, then we'll be more than okay. We'll have the romance of a lifetime. Every day we will live and love like it was our last day on earth together. Every second we will make count. So stay with me. Don't veer off the yellow brick road because home is where the heart is. Oh my God, the yellow brick road. I'm just watching Judy Garland, uh, Renee Zellweger's Judy saw, um, Over the Rainbow. And uh, oh my God, so if there's, a, if there's one person that had a difficult life, watch that film. It just makes you realise that we're all just bundles of stuff, <laughs> emotions. So letter 30. There's nothing that I wouldn't give to be with you, to share your life, to share our life together. I want us to be united in our love. I felt it too. I feel it too. Never think that I didn't because I did and I do. It's like a big giant clock. Oh my God, ticking in my heart. And the tick tock of the divine clock is chiming ever louder. Okay, well, that's the most insane sync ever. That's insane. Um, and the tick tock of the divine clock is chiming ever louder. A bit like a bomb timer waiting to go off, which is just like this looks. Oh, I know that our love is going to be explosive. Our love is going to be dramatic, devastatingly divine and wonderful. I want it so bad. Know that our time is coming. Our love is bringing us home. Believe in love. Oh my God, that's wild. <laughs> what an amazing sink. The tick of the divine clock. So if you have woken up and found you're in this crazy connection that you can't get letters, there'll be some messages and songs, there'll be number sequences, there'll be messages on reg plates, there'll be messages in conversations, there'll be messages through pets, through animals, through trees, through everything around you will start to come to life like an actual, like the whole entire universe is telling, talking to you, giving you a message from your twin spirit to say, stick with me. You know, this is happening. It's not you going crazy. Believe, believe, believe. That's the most insane sync. So I'm just going to read that letter again. That there's nothing that I wouldn't give to be with you, to share your life, to share our life together. I want us to be united in our love. I felt it too. I feel it too. Never think I didn't because I did and I do. It's like a big giant clock ticking in my heart and the tick tock of the divine clock is chiming ever louder. A bit like a bomb timer waiting to go off. I know that our love is going to be explosive. Our love is going to be dramatic, devastatingly divine and wonderful. And I want it so bad. Know that our time is coming. Our love is bringing us home. Believe in love. And the big lyric from the song <clears throat> was, When I wanted you to share my life, I had no doubt in my mind. And it's been you, woman, right down the line. And uh, there you go. That's the message. So I really hope that helps. And no matter what, remember, this is all about divine timing. No matter what it is that you're looking to manifest in your life, it's all about trusting, like raising your vibration, making sure that you are in the right frequency for the divine to work its magic. And that's the message. Look after you. Look after you and the divine will do the rest. Okay, I hope that helps. Take care. Bye.